Hello and welcome to channel Unlocks Hub. Today in this video I'll be showing you how to remove iCloud lock on an iPad. So here's an iPad which is currently iCloud locked. Before we begin the process, please hit the subscribe button and click on the bell icon to get notified as soon as we post a new video. Please do watch our other videos as well. We have done uh, many videos on multiple devices. If you have any doubts, please let us know in the comment section below the video. If you need the software, please mail us on our mail ID given in the description box below the video. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and click on the bell icon to get all the latest notification from our channel. So this is an iPad mini which is currently iCloud locked. As you can see, it is also lost and erased as well. So as you can see, I will be just connecting to iTunes so that you can get an idea what the iTunes says. So iTunes also says that this device has activation lock and this iPad was lost and erased as well. So let's begin the iCloud unlock process. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and click on the bell icon to get all our latest notifications and updates. Before we begin the process, you have to put the device to DFU mode. To do that, you have to hold the power button and the home button simultaneously. As soon as the device turns off, hold the power and the home button simultaneously. Once the logo disappears, let go of the power button, keep pressing the home button. As you can now see that uh, the iTunes says this uh, iTunes has detected an iPad in recovery mode. You must restore your iPad before it can be used with iTunes. Click on OK. So before you hit the restore, you have to open the 2018.exe application. Do not close this iTunes, let it be running in the background. Open 2018.exe application. Click on fetch OTA for all devices. As you can see here it says preparing. Once the preparation is done it starts downloading all the required hacks to do the iCloud unlock. As you can see it says preparing 100% it is almost done. to start the installation process. As you can see now it says fetching 100 SHSS so please uh, wait for it to complete the downloading process has to download 100 SHSS so please wait for it to complete. Also as you can see I am using the original USB cable so that I will not have any issues with the unlocking. Some uh, fake USB cables will not work fine. So make sure you are using the original cable. Also you will need an active internet connection for this 2018.exe application to run. As you can see here, uh, the downloading is now at 23%. It has to 
has to complete 100% before we proceed further. Click on the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to get notified as soon as we post a new video. If you have any doubts, please let us know in the comment section below. If you need the software, please mail us on our mail ID given in the description box below the video. This software even works on the iOS 12.1.3 which is the latest iOS version from Apple. We will be doing more videos on iOS 12.1.3. This is basically a permanent iCloud unlock. So once the process is completed, you can log in with your own Apple ID and password. done videos on many other devices like iPhone X, iPhone 7 Plus, iPhone 6 and many other devices. You can check that out as well. We will be doing more videos on latest Apple devices also. Make sure you hit the subscribe button and click on the bell icon to get notified as soon as we post a new video. Before you start the process, make sure you have downloaded the 2018.exe application and also the custom IPSW provided. Make sure all the software required software is downloaded. As you can see, uh, it just now completed 100%. Do not close this application, just minimize this application and open iTunes. Now all you have to do is hold shift and click on restore ipad and select the unlock sub ipad mini custom ipsw and uh, click on open it now says itunes will erase and restore your ipad click on ok it started extracting the software This custom IPSW installation takes a bit longer time than the normal IPSW installation. So make sure you have enough time to do it. This whole process takes somewhere around 25 to 30 minutes. Make sure you have enough time and you will also need an active internet connection, a working USB cable and a device which is iCloud Lock. Before you begin the process, make sure you charge your device till 100% so that you will not have any issues and also make sure you hard reset your device. the software please mail us on our mail id given in the description box below the video we have done videos on many apple devices you can just check them before you comment the extraction of the software is almost complete is preparing iPad for restore.
can now see the installation started already. You will need an active internet connection for this entire process. Without internet you cannot install an IPSW because it verifies the signature from Apple server. If you don't have an internet connection, there is a workaround. You will need a TTS server, you have to run a server and send the verification directly by all by yourself if you know to do that you can do it uh, without an internet connection but the 2018.exe application will definitely need an internet connection to download all the required hacks for the iCloud unlock process our previous videos every time it would download 98 SHSH so we have updated the software now it downloads 100 SHSH so this is the updated version the updated software is already given in the link so you can just download that release of uh, iOS 12.1.3 there were a few modifications so we have patched that as well so as before it would download 98 SHSH now it will download 100 SHSH as you can see See the installation is almost complete. your iPad has been restored to factory settings and is restarting, please leave your iPad connected. Do not unplug your device or do not close this 2018.exe application. Just wait for it to complete and wait for the iPad to turn on. As you can now see that the iPad is installing something. This is the stage where it loads the iCloud data back to the device. So basically, the iCloud data is stored in the device itself. So it loads back onto the device as soon as the IPSW installation is complete. Do 
not unplug your device. This is the phase where the 2018.exe application will be working in the background. Do not close it. If you have closed an application, just repeat the whole process. iPad only do not restore it from any of the previous backup please select setup as new iPad and click on continue wait for the iPad to turn on Also, the iTunes has started the synchronization. So, let me just set this up. I'll use the iTunes. I'll not be using Wi Fi. Welcome to iPad get started. You want get started. As you can see, this iPad is now iCloud unlocked. You can use everything. Let me just show that to you. Now let's go to iCloud and it says you can sign in with your own Apple ID or you can create a new Apple ID as well. So everything works here without any issues. So yes guys, this is how you remove the iCloud lock from an iPad or any iPhones or any Apple devices for that matter. If you need the software, please let us know by mailing us on a mail ID given in the description box below the video. If you have any doubts, please let us know in the comment section below the video. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and also click on the bell icon to get notified as soon as we post a new video. Thank you for watching. Take care. Bye bye.